transnasal esophagoscopy used to diagnose an esophageal squamous papilloma by Dr. Moshe Efrat. This is a case of a 30-year-old female with one-year history of difficulty swallowing. She denies any complaints of heartburn or cough. A screening esophagoscopy was performed using transnasal technique. Transnasal esophagoscopy is an excellent technique for screening since it requires only strictly topical anesthesia. Here we are visualizing the larynx and soon the patient will take a sip of water at which time we will enter the esophagus. The esophagus is visualized and the water is followed down to the esophageal and gastric junction. At the distal end of the esophagus, we identify a polypoid lesion. The patient was then sent for a GI evaluation and endoscopy for excision. Pathology came back as squamous papilloma. The stomach was also evaluated and negative for pathology. Esophageal squamous papillomas are rare lesions with less than 200 cases reported in the literature. These lesions may be associated with acid reflux and chronic irritation, as well as the HPV virus.